Hey, hey, good people. Arthur Moore is here. Hope all is well. In this video, we're, th we're looking at finding inputs and outputs of a two-step function um, that models a real-world situation. So you may want to pause the video and write down the problem. All right, so we have a construction crew needs to pave a road that is 206 miles long. The crew paves nine, nine miles of the road each day. The length L in miles that is left to be paved after D days is given by the following function. So the length uh, after a certain amount of days is given by the following function 206, which was the total that they had to pave minus nine miles per day. So part A says if 143 of the mile, 143 miles of the road is left to be paved, remember capital L stands for miles that are left to be paved. How many days has the crew been paving the road? So what we are given here is the L of D. So we're given the L of D. So we would say instead of L of D equals 206 minus 9D, we would say 143 to replace that L is equal to 206 minus nine times D and that will tell us how many uh, days the crew has been paving. So we solve this equation for D to figure that out. So the first thing we need to do to isolate D we want to subtract 206 from each side. So that gives us subtract 206 subtract 206 that gives us negative 63 equals negative nine times D. And then if we divide both sides by negative 9, then we know that D or days, that equals 7 days. So that tells us that the crew has been paving for 7 days if they have 100, 143 miles of road left to be paved. Okay, part 2 says how many miles of the road does the crew have left to pave so now we're looking for L how many miles of the road does the crew have left to pave after 13 days so they give us 13 days they give us uh, what to put in for the variable D so we're looking for L of 13 equals 206 minus 9 times 13 replacing D with 13. We're inputting 13 into this function to see what we get out. So we know that 9 times 13 is 117. And then 206 minus 117 tells us that uh, 89 miles are left to be paved after 13 days. So we've paved 117 miles total, so we only have 89 miles uh, remaining to be paved. Alrighty, good people, that's it for that problem. I hope you found it to be helpful. Make sure you pay attention to what is given. Uh, in part A, we were given 143 miles. That told me that I need to replace the L because it was in miles. In part B, we were given 13 days. That told me that I need to replace the D, which represents days. So make sure you pay attention to that and work these problems out. Hope you found it to be helpful, and I will see you on the next one. Thank you.